another parent and an advocate, activist uh, from the great city of Elizabeth School District. And um, tell us your name and what you do. Hi. <laughs> All right. Thank you for, uh, for having me. Uh, my name is Christina Marrera. Um, I run a Facebook page, Elizabeth Parents and Students Care. Uh, I started that page about three years ago because um, I was having an issue with park testing and finding resources. What is park? Park is the uh, standardized test used to um, gauge uh, how children are performing, um, and, and it's done by the, at the state level. Uh, but there's a lot of controversy behind PARC and the way it was uh, instituted and the way it was developed. And right now, in the state of New Jersey, it's become a graduation requirement. And uh, I also um, am an organizer for another group, Save Our Schools New Jersey, which is a grassroots uh, group which helps um, advocate on behalf of standardized testing and charter schools is another issue that they uh, are also involved with. Um, so you support charter schools? I do not support charter schools. Um, you know, you know, it's it's kind of a tricky issue because I was born and raised in Newark, and uh, I attended uh, Ann Street School down in Newark, and I know, and I and I work down there um, in a dental office. That's my real job. Uh, so I know the struggles of parents who are sending their kids to what essentially uh, people are calling failing schools, schools that are not up to to par. And you know, you want the best for your child now. You know, you don't want to wait to have to fight the system to get your child into a school. So I understand people wanting to get something better, but what happens with charter schools is they're pulling valuable dollars out of our public school system uh, to take with them to charter schools, and then they're saying that our public schools aren't succeeding. Um, does something need to be done to address it? Yes. You know, we need to find a better way uh, to, to help our public schools succeed. But I don't think pulling dollars out of our public schools to send to charter schools, especially the for-profit ones, uh, is the answer. So I was going to say, because Plainfield right now, they had 500 students walked out because their charter school had pulled so much funding from their school district, mm -hmm. it's, it's caused them to now cut you right. know, right. teachers and all kinds of programs in the school system. Exactly, exactly. And, and that's, what, that's what happens. And that's what I am opposed to. So I'm not necessarily opposed to uh, you know, charter schools in general, uh, but the whole, this big push now, especially with this new administration, uh, this big push for, for charter schools everywhere at, at, at all costs, you know, is something that really needs to be slowed down and, and looked at and, and examined. Um, so this is how I became kind of involved was through the park testing, um, the, the standardized test that they use, and now it's implemented for, for graduation requirements. And, um, you know, I, I couldn't find any real information about Elizabeth, what the policies were here in Elizabeth. So I said, you know what, let me start a page and I'll invite some parents I know and we can talk about issues that are happening in Elizabeth. And so it just kind of grew like that. And then I attended my first board meeting about a year, uh, three years ago. And I was dumbfounded and blown away at virtually what was a circus that was happening here with people yelling at each other and, you know, all sorts of craziness. And so that's how I became involved and, and started to educate parents about what was going on at, at the district level. And, uh, and then we just kind of, you know, progress from there. Well, you're doing a good job. I'm trying. What we need is more parents to be involved. You know, uh, the, the, it can't just be the same two or three parents showing up at the board meetings or, or talking about the same issues. We need more parents to get involved. How do they contact you? They can contact me by going on our Facebook page, Elizabeth Parents and Students Care, uh, my own personal page, Christina Marrera, um, and obviously you can, you can inbox me um, on my Facebook page. Um, so those are, the, those are probably the best two ways to, to contact me. Um, so yeah, that's what, that's what we're trying to do. We Thank just need more parental involvement. That's what we need. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right. right. Thank you. Thank you.